Hello everyone. In this session, we will discuss about the effects of cross magnetization of R major reaction. If cross magnetization is done, what are the effects in the R? What are the effects by the R major reaction? We should look at here. So, first we will look at what is R major cross magnetization effect. So generally, we have three things. One is demagnetization. That means the resultant flux will be increases. Next, magnetization. The resultant flux will be cross uh, magnetization. Resultant flux will be increases. Next, cross magnetization. This cross magnetization is neither increase the flux nor decrease the flux, but it will change the waveform. For example, flux waveform is like this. If the cross magnetization effect is done on it, then the waveform shape will be changed slightly. That means it will have the waveform is like this. Waveform is like this. So this is the effect of the cross magnetizing. But neither increase the flux nor decrease the flux. This is the important thing. Here, the MNA will shift in the direction of generator rotation. The angle of shift theta is proportional to the magnitude of load. So generally, generally we have the magnetic neutral axis is at here. This is the part. But due to the effect, it will be shift to the generator. Generator will be rotates in clockwise direction. That's why the magnetic neutral axis means this point will become at this position at this position in this is the mna position this is initially mna position but due to the cross magnetizing effect it will be shifted it will be shifting the angle is theta but how much it will be decided by the magnitude of the load if the load value increases then shifting will be continuously increases okay here the important thing is generator rotation is like this this is the generator rotation that means it is the clockwise direction what is the motor rotation here the motor is there the motor rotation is the anti-clockwise direction anti-clockwise direction that means this is the anti-clockwise direction yeah so cross magnetizing effect will shift the magnetic neutral axis so how how it shifts so i will give some clarification here the shifting will be the shifting will be like this yeah so here not there is no thing available here but i will explain the thing here All right what is another effect the iron losses is increases so due to the cme iron losses size increases iron losses what is the another name for iron losses we can name it as the core losses core losses also name it as the iron losses how it increases whenever the maximum flux density increases then automatically iron losses will be increases here what are the types of iron losses two losses are there one is the hysteresis losses another one is the eddy current losses okay hysteresis losses is the maximum flux is uh, it is a maximum flux power 1.6 and eddy current losses here the maximum flux density whole square so that's why the iron losses both will be increases what is the problem with this iron losses iron losses is nothing but the losses part of the losses when the losses increases the efficiency will be decreases so finally by the cross magnetizing effect the efficiency will be decreased here efficiency will be decreased next poor commutation poor commutation what is the meaning of commutation so name itself there is a poor commutation is done that what is the commutation it is a commutation is the process which converts from ac to dc ac to dc that is done by the this process is done by the commutator done by the commutator if the poor commutation means poor commutation means so we will discuss here 
what happened look at here if the flux along the brush axis is zero then the voltage is zero so for example you can take it this is the brush axis this will be the brush axis okay yeah this point if the flux along the this is the flux brush axis is zero then the voltage is zero so there is no voltage and automatically current is zero then the commutation is set to be the ideal or good so when the two cases is possible that means here the case this is the brush axis case at this point at this point then automatically commutation is said to be ideal or good no problem at all but due to the effect of cross magnetization effect cross magnetization effect what is the problem with the cross magnetization effect is the flux will be shifted flux will be shifted like this that means we have at this point we have some fluxes available at this point some fluxes available yeah so but due to the effect of the cross magnetizing effect there always exists some flux along the brush axis so this is the brush axis it has some flux the flux cut by the coil under the commutation process so in the commutation we have the coils is available that coil cut by this flux therefore an emf is induces so whenever conductor cuts the flux conductor cuts the flux what happened an emf is induces emf is induces here okay which will drive the current so automatically whenever the emf is induces automatically current will be produces okay which will drive the current in the coil itself thereby causes a slow commutation or under commutation whenever this process is done we can call it when current is increases that is called the under commutation we can name it as the under commutation due to which sparking get the brushes then automatically some sparking will be produced some sparking will be produced okay this is called the poor commutation generally what is the meaning of commutation commutation means in the brushes generally we should have and the brushes zero current current must be the zero but this poor commutation at the brushes we have some current value we have some current value okay yeah so commutation is the very very important part that that should be look at here right next the conductors next problem which are existing under the trailing pole trip cuts the maximum value of the flux generally what happened the trailing pole trip you know that the trailing pole trip is at the trailing pole trip so what happened the flux value at the trailing pole trip the flux value increases generally flux value increases so the emf value also increases and the emf will become the maximum emf if the exceeds the bnd particular value so emf is generally we have some particular value uh, what happen the insulation will fail increases what happen the insulation will fail so we will lose the insulation then short circuit under commutation segments and armature coils so generally the commutator is like this it consisting of the some segments and the coils commutator generally it consisting of the segments right these segments all are short circuited and armature coils are short circuited this process will extend the entire commutation due to that the commutation process will extended finally short circuit of the total commutator by this the total commutator will be short circuited commutator will also will become the short circuited which causes big flash over due to that effect the big flash over is done big flash over is done the insulation failed is a, a bigger trouble to the commutator that means a big flash over occur that big flash over gives 
ये फेलिंग ऑफ द कॉमोटेटर ओके सो दीज आर द क्रॉस मैग्नेटाइजिंग इफेक्ट सो वन सेकेंड रिकलेक्ट वॉट आर द इफेक्ट हियर फर्स्ट पॉइंट when cross magnetizing effects then automatically the brush axis will be shift brush axis will be shift the second the iron losses will be increases and the third the commutation is poor how we can say the commutation is poor generally when the whenever the commutation is done at the brush axis the flux will be zero but due to the cross magnetizing effect we have some flux due to the flux emf emf induces some current then current whenever the current is there then automatically flash over will be possible and the fourth and due to the generally effect of the trailing port trip flux will be increases that will mica insulation will be in, failed whenever insulation will be failed and short circuit of the commutator segments then automatically big flash over is possible these are the different different uh, effects the adverse effects on the dc machine due to the cross magnetizing effect so cross magnetizing when cross magnetizing affected more on the affected more on the dc machine so we should reduce this cross magnetizing effect okay i hope all of you understand the session thank you